Hi, and welcome to a very special Halloween episode of The Silver Show. A show that combines your favorite phantom with your favorite things. This week we'll find out how to pick the right puppy, have an episode of A Hero Wear, and, as you can see, I'm dressed up as... As you can see, I'm dressed up for this Halloween episode. All of the cast will be dressed up, and, they'll be for, and they will be performing their roles dressed up in their costume. But not only that, before I skip to the segments, I will sh- question them. Now, I'm dressed up as an iPod owner's worst nightmare, the untangled... Tangled up earphones, which are hard to untangle. Now, but first, before I interview people about their costumes, let's see what Tails is is and what he reviewed this week. Thank you, Silver. This week, I'll be reviewing Counting Thunder's new city, It's Entertainment. <laughs> um... This Irish band is smooth and energetic at the same time. Most of their songs are covers, but they're good nonetheless. There's olden time songs such as Bad, Bad, Leroy Brown, I'm standing on the corner, watching all the girls go by. Sorry, I'm a bad singer. And then there's an original called Do Wackadoo. And with Glee's recently acquired Damian McGinty in the band, this makes for an amazing CD. There's also a DVD of it as well, but this CD has extra songs that aren't on the DVD. Thank you, Tails. I might have to go buy that myself. Now, before we go on to the next segment, would you please welcome Sonic to see what he's dressed as? And what he's going to do for Halloween. Please welcome Sonic. Sonic, please come out. Hello, Silver. Please take a seat, Sonic. Don't mind if I do. Now, Sonic, what are you dressed as for Halloween? What are you dressed as today, and what are you dressing as for Halloween? Well, I'm dressed as Superman today. But, for Halloween, I think I might... Dress as Mario, you know. Split the odds. Split the odds. And how do you think you perform today? I mean, your segment hasn't been seen yet. So how do you think you perform in your skit or whatever you're doing today? I think with a cape, it might just be easy. So I saw some of the others. That might be hard, but... Yeah. That's all. What's your favorite part of Halloween, Sonic? My favorite part of Halloween would have to be the pumpkin carving, of course. Because I can speed carve a pumpkin. I can't do it now, of course. But, you know, you should go over and watch me speed carve a pumpkin sometime. Okay, thank you, Sonic. Please thank Sonic. Thank you, everybody. Show off your costume, Sonic. Don't mind if I do. Here's my lovely Superman costume to everyone. Thank you for having me, for letting me show you my Superman costume. And away I fly. Yes. That was Sonic, just as Superman. Now our next segment... Sorry, now, unfortunately, we can't get around to doing an interview this episode. So instead, we'll have the second episode of A Hero Where. And when we first left Supernox, we've been bombarded by Rock Hard Donuts and Dr. Shadclaw, and he's been got away with the McSulter fire. Will Supernox be able to find them? Let's find out. And there we are, sir. You had to break the McSulter fire, minion. Sorry, sir. Come on, Minion, let's go. <laughs> Come on, hurry up, Minion. I'm coming, sir. Coming, sir. Coming, sir. 
coming to uh, uh, Hong Kong, huh? Couldn't even carry it across the road. I apologize, sir. But it might have been a truck was about to hit me. Anyway, I don't think that matters now. I've just added the last part to this new machine, my lord. Yes, yes, I suppose so. Mind me asking what it is, sir? Uh, hmm. I need to explain this to the superheroes, but you'll have to do, Minion. You see, this is my... I don't have a name for it yet, but it stops anyone that steps within two feet of it. And I can torture them as much as I like. I can torture them as much as I like. Smart move, sir. Indeed, Minion. Speaking of superheroes, I wonder how that super nuts is doing. Covered in all those rock hard donuts. Oh my, it doesn't matter. Turn it on and call my ex wife so we can test it. Yes, sir. I suppose you better set up a table for her. You know, so get suspicious. I suppose I better set up a table for her, you know. She'll get suspicious and she'll get suspicious if I haven't invited her for any dinner. She'll get suspicious if I haven't invited her for any dinner. Nah. You sound too close to that. There we are. Let's get out of the way. Can wait for her to come. Oh, how rude that sounds. Huh? What's this? Shadowanium? Oh, he's coming in to apologize. How sweet. He's coming in to apologize. How sweet of you, dear. I can't move. What's going on? I just wanted you to test out my new machine, dear. I just wanted you to test out my new machine, dear. Um. My new machine, dear. Thank you for complying. Um, uh, thank you for complying. You've done your little test. You've done your little test. Can you let me go? Oh, no, it's not over. See, as soon as my minion turns the machine around, you'll drop into a pit of fiery lava. After you get all, through all the garbage, if there's any. Someone will, after you get through all the garbage, if there's any. Someone will stop you. Please, the super guy left covered in rock hard turns. He hasn't even got here yet. I don't know why. Doesn't matter. Minion? Minion, where'd you run off to? Do I need a leash for you? Where are you? Minion! Wow, I wonder if simple enough to discover what his power is so he can escape. Find out next time. And when buying it, 
Sorry, um, and, um, we all saw a tale as well as dressed as something, but what was he dressed as? Would you please welcome Tails before the next segment to see what he is dressed as? Please welcome Tails. Tails, please welcome Tails. Tails, 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 please welcome Tails. Please welcome Tails. Ah, Silver, take a seat, Tails. Yeah, so, we'll take a good seat. Now, Tails, what are you dressed as? Well, I'm dressed as an angel, and what I'm dressing as for Halloween is the same thing. Since I couldn't put a puppet costume together, but then. You were pretty good in your costume in your scene, didn't you? Well, yes, I think I did pretty well. What's your favorite part about Halloween, Tails? My favorite part about Halloween is the trick-or-treating, because I love knocking on doors and getting candy. Who doesn't? <laughs> That's right. Now, Tails, would you mind showing off your lovely angel costume to the viewers? Oh, not at all. Not at all, still, huh? I was about to call you tails. <laughs> Here's my lovely angel costume. <laughs> lovely, lovely, lovely. Do you like it? Yes. You're all good little boys and girls. Thank you. Thank you, Silva. Yes. Thank tails. Thank tails, everybody. Huh, now, um, when buying a new pet, you have to be careful and choose wisely or else it could be a disaster. Now, using dogs, here's Sonic with a step-by-step -step guide on picking out the right puppy. Or should I say, here's Superman with his step-by-step -step guide. Thanks, Silver. Or earphones. Picking out the right puppy is something hard for some people. So if you follow these steps, you'll have the perfect puppy. Step one, always have a parent with you and stick with them at all times. I mean, actually, you'd end up getting kidnapped. Oh, look at this one. Oh, look at this one. Ah, uh, mommy. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Sweetie. Stay close to me. Step two. When looking for a dog, make sure they're looking at you and are energetic. Like myself. Otherwise you'll end up with a lazy pet, which in turn will make you lazy. Which in turn will make you lazy. Oh, I like this one. That one. That one. Yeah. So cute, isn't it? Eh. 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 Make sure they're vaccinated and de-sexed, unless you want to herd of puppies running around. And last but not least, step four, make sure to inquire if the dog is friendly before you ask to let...
Back to you, headphones. <laughs> <laughs> Back to your headphones. I'm very sorry about that. Please forgive us with our little skit. That tale should have been listening to Sonic. Or the Angel should have been listening to Superman, should I say. Now, um... Before we go, I'd just like to say that we've totally scrapped the reaction segment, and in its place next week, we'll be in the bowl. Which is where I ask people questions and to you, awesome. Next week, the creator of the show, Kev, will be in the poll. Submit your question from either of these Tumblr, Huffle Along Now, Sir, which should be on the screen, or his Twitter, Droplet underscore Dude, which also will be on the screen, hopefully. We will have a Twitter next week so you can send the questions directly to us. Or you can just leave a comment below with the question you'd like to ask. And we might just pick it. Now, as I said before the show, we're two p- people at the cast and we're missing out on seeing their costumes, aren't we? Though you did see them perform in their show. Let's bring them out, shall we, one by one. First, let's bring out, um, Shadow and see what he's dressed as. Let's bring out Shadow. Let's bring out Shadow. Shadow. Shadow, shadow, shadow. Hello, shadow. Hello, Summer. Take a seat. So, Shadow, what are you dressed as today, and what are you dressing as on Halloween? Well, today I'm dressed as Edward Scissorhands, and tomorrow I'll be dressing as... I mean, not tomorrow, on Halloween. I'll be dressing as, um, another evil dude. Not sure who yet. Okay, and um, how do you think you went in your scene? Or in your show? Well, it was pretty hard being Dr. Shanklaw with this, but I think I managed. And what's your favorite part about Halloween? Scaring little kids and taking away their candy, that's the best part of Halloween. Okay, shut up. Mind showing the viewers your Edward Scissorhands costume? (sighs) Yes, here you are. It's my lovely Edward Scissorhands costume. I've got the head too, just to let you know. Lovely Edward Scissorhands costume, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Shadow. And now let's bring out the last person. The goddess asking what he, why he was dressed like that today. Knuckles, please bring on Knuckles. Hello, Silver. So, Knuckles, what are you dressed as today? And what are you dressing as for Halloween? And what are you dressing as for Halloween? Well, today I'm dressed as, um... Maybe I should start with Halloween first. Uh, Halloween I'm dressing as, um... Halloween I'm dressing as, um, uh... Jack Skeleton, and... Today... I'm dressed as, um... A princess. And why are you dressed as a princess, not? Well, actually, Rouge. I made a deal with Rouge, and I lost. The deal was that I had to wear a princess costume if I lost the deal. And your favorite part about Halloween? This is dressing up, except for this part. Um, except for this part. <laughs> but the dressing up in general is your favorite character. This is my favorite part about Halloween. And show the viewers your lovely... Princess costume. Oh, do I have to? Yes, you have to, Nux. Alright, then. Here, everybody. 
Here's my lovely princess costume that Rouge forced me to wear today. Don't I look like one? Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Yeah. I bet you enjoyed this very special Halloween episode of The Silver Show. Join us next week, and we won't find out anything. <laughs> mm. <laughs> no, just kidding, we probably will. Hopefully we'll have an interview by then. Thanks for watching.